As Grenada starts to roll out plans to celebrate the island's 50th anniversary of independence, the St. George's Northeast Independence Committee says their community will not be left behind. The seven-member team is in the initial stage of planning an award ceremony and a dinner for individuals who made a significant contribution to their community. Derek James, chair of the committee, says the team was established in May of this year. He spoke of the plans that will be implemented in the constituency at St. George Northeast to celebrate the occasion. The first thing we did was to look at the question of two activities. One, the activity to recognize the people, and secondly, to have some sporting and cultural activities. Right now, we are concentrating on having the recognition activity, the recognition ceremony, is carried for the 2nd of February, 2024. And it will be held right here at Spice Basket. And we have um, decided to look at the areas of health, sports, community service, culture, agriculture, and business. We are going to decorate, we're going to do some decoration in the community to lead, leading up to this activity. And we are hoping to have the broad community come here. It will be a free activity. It would not be of any cost to anyone. Executive member of the committee, Dr. Sonia Nixon, explained that candidates from the awards ceremony will be recognized in seven categories. This will be done through subcommittees set up in different villages that will receive nominations from community members. In this 50th year, we're going to recognize 50 people to start with, 50 people who have done your man's tasks in, en in ensuring that Grenada has maintained and has grown, um, maintained its status and has grown even further um, in the last 50 years. So far on seven areas, health, education, agriculture, culture, sports, um, community development, and business, that we're gonna recognize people from the area and what they have, who have made significant contributions to Grenada as a whole. Hugh Darlan, another executive member of the committee, stated that they will be seeking the help of businesses in the community to raise funds for the events planned. On the whole question of sponsorship, obviously this is a, a pretty costly exercise. Um, we are hopeful that we are going to get some support from the government um, in helping us to make this a reality. However, we also intend to contact a number of our businesses who are from the Northeast. We are of the view that this is a Northeast event, and I think we have enough businesses from the Northeast that can really and truly carry the financial load in order to make it happen. The committee members were speaking at a press conference on Monday morning. Rena Pet Thomas, GBN News.